Get in a bit closer and then throw it into the cave. Go on, Arthur. Hello guys, welcome to part of the Red Dead Redemption 2 walkthrough. So in the last part, we finally arrived back from Gorma and we checked on the Shady Bell which was our last moon camp. Uh, Miss Shady Adler cleverly left a clue, clue there of, her, of the gang's current location in a letter. That was very smart of her. So we eventually found our gang in this swamp. But it again went south when Pinkerton Detective Agency, Mr. Milton, was able to find us in the swamp and it led to a shootout right here. But our gang survived. But we now know that the police know our location. So we have to move out from this location quickly. So we are looking into that and Miss Sadie Adler has gone ahead to scout for John who was captured when we did the bank robbery so we have to free him as well from the police so that is also our priority but right now let's see what Dutch has planned right. us Two. planned for us Three. next you okay there working it all out once and for all Arthur mm. what now we're back and I'm sitting here and I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess move. Those oily actors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us. And they are going to have us. Well, maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just... <laughs> I can't help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. <laughs> but the, the game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my my final move. But I guess I'm more interested in saving lives than winning a chess. And maybe life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly. No doubt. What about the women? You sound like Jose. I miss. Um, I asked you a question. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we gonna run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. Arthur, do you have my bag? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your bag to worry about. <laughs> we need more money. We've been on the run for months now, and I seen you. Killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to. Mm. And I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we just... There is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek. I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you can take folks up that way. Micah and I need to do some reconnaissance. I ain't got a final plan yet. Arthur, I ain't got it. I just need time. I need time and no traitors. Alright. Let's see if we can buy you sometime then. I guess we are moving all the gang to that location that just spoke of. So let's scout the area with Charles. Charles. Be right with me. Always. Let's go. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. Smithing through country. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. Expect trouble. <laughs> I understand. What are we doing there? We're looking for a place to hold up. Even the law won't follow us up there too willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while your boys were away. And? Hmm. You'll see. Alright. <sighs> kind of cryptic. I know the way. Follow me. But let's see anyway. 
what Charles has scouted. We need to get this done fast. The Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. Yeah, the sooner we get out of here, the better. Definitely. We don't want another full fledged police attack on us. News near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher mm. Creek. Might be quicker. What do you think? Try for a boat or not? You still with me there? Yeah, a boat's probably a good idea. Okay, good. It's good to see you again, Charles. You too. Thanks for what you did in Sam Denis. Real brave drawing them off us like that. I was worried you and Abigail had both got yourselves killed. I found a spot to lie low for a while, then managed to get a ride with a wagon of workers heading out to the fields. Abigail said she somehow managed to slip away when they grabbed Isaiah. You did good getting the others out of there, keeping everyone together. Everybody was pretty shaken up when I got back to Shady Bell. Uh, it was a tough few days. I couldn't have done it without Sadie. So how did you find that spot back then? I assume the skulls on sticks weren't in addition to yours. Huh. Old Strauss knew about it. The locals are terrified of the place, so we figured that might buy us some time. And it did. Until one of you brought the law with you. Where did you end up again? Cuba? Oh, uh, not exactly. An island off of there called Warma. Landed ourselves in a heap of trouble. Really? A tropical island? Isn't that just what Dutch wanted? Uh, I guess it didn't exactly live up to his ideals. Anyway, I ain't always sure Dutch knows what he wants anymore. There's the bridge. <laughs> there should be some canoes down to the right here. Okay, let's take a boat. I hope our horses follow us. Or anyway, we are Come coming back to this position. Anyway, works with me. Let's clean this gun. The condition is pretty bad. Wait up, Charles. I'm just cleaning my weapons. Alright, let's move out. Let's go. Butcher Creek is a few miles up river. So I spent some time up this way while you were gone. I ran into rains fall and eagle flies. Okay, I have to control the wood. I thought that I just have to roll and Charles will do the rest too. Apparently not. But now I think I might regret to use a foot over horses. <laughs> Traveling by boat is very slow. I think we might be able to sneak past some guards. But let's see how this works out. Great! didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here. Not a crazy idea. This is a spot nobody comes near, even the law. Just be ready. That's true. It won't be pretty. So be it. We have to drive the residents first, of course. Thank God that's a cutscene. I thought that we have to roam all the way to the objective. That would have taken so long. Oh. We have rapids in the river. Okay, we are now carrying the boat. <laughs> Nice protection from rain. I think we are at the spot near it. Just we have to be careful here, like Charles said before. 
This is a rough area, rough country, county. Someone there with that lamp. That's Butcher Creek up ahead. Who are they? The locals. Uh, they <laughs> too friendly. Wait till you meet the Murphys. Let's walk it from here. Sure. Good evening. Well, this looks like a shady village to me. Come on, Charles. Walk quickly with there. Yeah, sure, let's grab these horses. Why waste stamina? Then you can ride there. Easy. You can see why folks don't want to come around here. Ain't exactly a welcoming <laughs> place. Lots of stories of people going missing around these parts. Just recently, a stagecoach from Annisburg disappeared without a trace coming through here. Guess that's good for us. Mm -hmm. Assuming these inbred bastards are willing to part with their home, which I'm sure they won't be too pleased about. No, but I believe they hide out all over Roanoke Ridge. These caves are just one of their spots, which is why we should keep it down. They might have lookouts around. Okay. You see that up ahead? Slow down, keep it quiet. It could be some of them. Yes, enemies. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. Yes, keep our gun in handy. Stay quiet. Or knife. Let's get yes. closer to him. We have to follow them to their hideout. We also have to be careful. Up this way. Like Charles said before, there may be lookouts all over the place. Definitely Murphy's. I say we deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. Why do I always gotta do the carrying? Because I do the skinning. Quick, Arthur. I do the skinning. Then who do the carrying? You're a son of a bitch, you know that? You stupid. That was close. Let's go, Arthur. We must be close now. Let's stop and have a look from the top of this hill there. Wait, I have to do this bastard. Oh, they don't have anything on us. On them. <laughs> Not us. It's nice that we got a machete now. Okay, I think this is their camp. Okay. Let's see what's going on. That's the stagecoach went missing. Okay, we now know why the stagecoach went missing. It was just robbed. Jesus. Oh my god. Damn. They must be in the cave. Are these right. cannibals? Let's get on with this. Okay. What do you think? Into the cave or flush them out with dynamite. Let's do dynamite. I don't want dynamite to go into that cave. <laughs> yeah. Let's be quiet and hope they don't come out. I'm Let's much comfortable in with. the open. Get in a 
bit closer and then throw it into the cave. Go on, Arthur. What happened? Cha what? You did not tell me to cover him. <laughs> I thought that he could he can take care of himself. That was kind of crazy. He goes running like he can take care of himself. Protect each other man, they are all with melee weapons, I think. They have to watch out for each other. at all. Do we look like cannibals to you, miss? Okay. We are sophisticated guys. <laughs> at least look at our clothes. Let's go. Where are you from? Antisburg. What do we do with her? Take her there and go get the others. Sure. Miss. You okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. She used to be in shock. Huh? Uh. I understand. Right? Yes. They. 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 they um. It's okay, miss. The others, they. They killed them. You're safe now. Just. Try to breathe. They're animals. I know. It's all right, miss. Why would they? 
they are animals, like you said. <laughs> Some folks is just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain it. I haven't slept in days. <laughs> I know. What's your name, miss? It's okay. Meredith. You're gonna be home soon, Meredith. And this will all be over. Thank you. Where in Annisburg? Oh. One of the mining cottages. Um, <laughs> if you get me to the main street, I can show you from there. Okay. Okay. Let's be careful while riding now. <laughs> I have seen hostages getting killed because they are thrown off the horseback. <laughs> so we have to be careful or we will fail this mission. Look at that, the NPCs don't even try to dodge us. <laughs> I still don't get it how the NPC and algorithm is so broken. The NPCs don't try to dodge us when we Just are crashing the into them. It'll be easier to walk from there. All right. Here we are, Miss. Yes. Oh. Oh. Thank God. Which place is yours? Up at the top of the hill. It's near the blacksmith. Mama. Ma! Ma! Meredith! She's alive! Oh, she's alive! We saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy Brew guys. Oh my god. How did you manage to? I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me give you this. Nah, no, it's okay. Oh, that, that's okay, ma'am. You just keep her warm and keep her safe. Sometimes we got to go the do, got to do the good deeds. This is death. Oh no! You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Who is she? Thanks, buddy. I think I remember her from one of the previous missions. I think we collected a debt from her. She was moving out of her house. Long back. Way too long back. At the beginning of the game. If I remember correctly. I think we found ourselves a new location to camp for a few days. Yes. How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. Took her home. Oh. You and Mike can find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend Mr. Cornwall. You did? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Mike and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, Dodge! Did you miss me? I found her. Drunk in San Denis. You're back. How jolly, Miss O'Shea. It's funny, you suck of shit. Back Who and you? drunk. The master, the Lord Molly, God, all my calm need. down. I won't be ignored. George Vanderlyn, I honored him. I ain't her. I ain't his stooges. Calm yourself, You don't know me nothing. Miss. I don't know you nothing. Nothing. Okay. Drunk. Spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry. I told him, I tell him again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who? What? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross. And they took my glory. And I wanted them to kill you. You did what? No, no, no. I loved you, you goddamn bastard. Go on, shoot me. She ain't worth it. You told on me. You betrayed me. Fine. You calm down. Arthur? Get her out of here. You know the rules. You are not so big now. Are we, Your Majesty? You. Take her. <laughs> she knew Damn. the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you. Quit 
You're lollygagging. Yeah. Get back to work. That was a twist. I did not think that one of our gang members would betray us. Anyway, beginning of new chapter. Beaver Hollow. Okay, so that's the new location of our camp. Beaver Hollow. I assume. We have to shave real quick. We have the beer is outgrown. We can visit Saint Denis to the barber and cut our hair. Shave. Okay, we have a shaving kit now. That's good. It's okay. Our TB is flaring up again. Okay, um, some of you guys may not know, I just explored Saint Denis on my own. So we are going to miss Sadie Adler and it turns out that Arthur has TB apparently. So I think uh, we will get to that part and we go miss, visit Miss Sadie, Sadie Adler. Okay, that can work for now. Much better. Look. Hello there, uncle. Stop being always drunk, man. Okay, the new camp is set up now. In Beaver Hollow, I assume. So you think... You think Dutch has lost his mind, Arthur? I don't know. I'm not sure I even care. Well, Mike... Micah says you've been saying crazy things about him. Micah. <laughs> Keep an eye for Micah, Bill. He says a whole lot. Okay. Alright guys, so let's stop here for this part. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also share the video with your friends. I'll see you guys in the next part. Peace.